Welcome back to Odyssey News Evening Edition. I am Mike Odyssey. And yes, I have another discovery for you. It's not a leak. Yeah, it could be a leak. Maybe a leak. But it's basically a patent that Nintendo just filed that has to do with VR. Yes, VR. And this is connected to many other patents that have been pa found, not pound, found throughout our journey here to, uh, on the patent discovery board, you know. And uh, let's go ahead and talk about it because this could be potential... Uh, a potential patent that could be related to the next Nintendo Switch because, or the next console, right? Or a potential VR uh, headset that Nintendo is using, right? This is a, a one that's in conjunction with that. So if we put them all together, we can actually get basically like Nintendo's next VR system. So let's go ahead and start. All right, before we get started, we are giving away a Nintendo Switch OLED Pokemon Edition. All you got to do is subscribe, and the winner will be chosen at our 20K subscriber milestone video. All right, so we are here at the patent. I'm not going to waste any of your time. Here it is, right? It's it's it Basically, it was issued today, January 17, 2023, right? And, of course, as you can see here, applicant name, Nintendo Co. LTD, Kyoto, in Japan. And um, when was it filed? It was filed on November 16, 2022. Publication data says May 19, 2022. Here in the abstract, it talks about the virtual uh, setting of what it is: a virtual reference plane and a virtual in a virtual camera are, are updated based on the detection of a characteristic portion in a captured image. Okay, so basically, I'm not gonna read all that. I'm not gonna bore you. Uh, I know you want to see the images because the images paint the picture. I guess it's a picture, right? And here is the first one. Here we have. What looks like a device, like a phone, um, not any phone I've seen before, uh, but it looks like a device right here. Um, and it looks like the same device that they have in other patents, right? The other patents show a VR headset that people have on and then other players are holding a device like this. So right here, here we have an image of a, of a basically a, an image of a device looks like a smartphone and, and it looks like you have a puppy, a virtual puppy. You got to place it right there, right? And then we have we have more other devices here or more images here that that show basically the same exact thing. Let's go ahead and go down. And here we have it. This is basically the room, the device. And here you are placing the puppy. Puppy looks really sad because it's probably floating. Uh, and then we see here uh, again the same exact thing. And then it looks like it's uh, there. there's a spot there where you can actually place the puppy. And here we continue. The puppy has been placed for some reason. And then there we have it. You can actually place it again. It, this is like a little camera thing there. And then th there's three dots here. This is really weird because it doesn't look like a phone to me. It has three dots down here. And it has this thing back here. This could actually be a Nintendo device. You never know. Uh, and then this is just like an example of what it is. Um, and then right here, again, this is the puppy. It looks like place again, moving it. Puppy still looks sad. And continue here. Oh no, puppy's doing something. I don't know. I think it's maybe the. I'm not, I'm not gonna speculate. You speculate on what the puppy is doing, but it's actually facing backwards, and you can see the tail. And then, basically, basically that's the pattern, right? It actually tells you why is the puppy doing a split. <laughs> I'm not, 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 not understanding this. But anyway, this is the pattern here, which shows uh, VR, right? VR, a uh, virtual reality. And this is more like AR, um, argumented reality, because you show parts of the we of the real world and also like a fake world basically vr vr is is fully immersive and ar is argumented reality so it's basically putting up a headset looking at the real world and then seeing something imposed over the real world and that's what ar is and i think this is more ar than vr so there you have it guys this is the patent i found uh today um having to do with ar what the do the dog is hat is, is he walking? What's going on here? This is weird. Anyway, but you can see other things here. Various programs, operation data, captured image data, virtual uh, reference plane data, uh, and a lot more, you know? So uh, I guess this is basically the, the, the software. It's end game. So it's actually, it's actually a game. And maybe Nintendo's releasing a mobile game. Who knows? Um, there's a lot to speculate here. But I just wanted to bring this up to you guys so you guys can, you know, look at it, uh, make up your mind of what you think it is. And I would really love to know what you guys think this is uh, down below in the comments. 
if you think that maybe this is a virtual game nintendo is working on for mobile devices you can put that down below maybe you, if you think that nintendo is working on vr technology for the next console then you can also put that down below if you think this is nothing go ahead and write down below guess what i value every single opinion okay um that's just still image acquired so yeah this is basically the patent um it just shows you a lot of information a lot of jibber jabber blubber but uh yeah what do you guys think about this patent what do you guys think about this uh this puppy that's kind of doing something there doing like a little split now he's standing up right there it looks just weird that looks just weird um but there you have it the puppy is flying and uh um you can see the puppy right there doing a split and that's it puppy splitting um and, and this basically device with three dots back here and um it looks like a phone so let me know what you guys think down below and guess what that's it for this video <laughs> we'll, we'll go ahead and see you in the next one but before i let you go i got two more important things i want to let you know number one never ever give up and number two journey on peace we're on a journey looking back on the things that we've taken for granted but feels like we're learning to be better